Zotero can be used to create shared libraries, which is useful if you're going to be working on team projects or with collaborators. To create a group, you must first create a Zotero account and log into it. Click on Login in the top right-hand corner to access your account. Then, enter your username and password. To create a group, click on the Groups tab at the top. First, you must pick a name for your group and enter it in the box shown on this page. Then, select the type of group you want. The public options mean that anyone online can access your group. If you want your group to be private and by invitation only, select the private membership option. Once you've chosen a name and the type of membership of your group, click on Create Group. The settings page will appear. Here, you can decide who has permission to read and edit your shared Zotero library. Once you are satisfied with the settings, click on Save Settings. To add contributors to your group, click on Members Settings. Then, click on Send More Invitations. Add the email addresses of the contributors you wish to invite and click on Invite Members. If you go back to your Zotero program and click on Refresh, you will now see your new group. Your shared folder will function exactly like your other folders. To add items to it, simply slide them from your Zotero library or add them directly from the library catalog or a database.